Time to get out and about with your family this weekend. I've got my weekend adventures lined up for you. And as I mentioned, it's finally here, the John Ball Zoo. It's opening. The zoo will open right after our show, right here at 10 a.m. this morning. It has all the exotic animals waiting to see you. Check out the new wallaby exhibit or take to the skies with that high flying zip line. Plus, check out the incredible artwork from that washed ashore collection. All the art made from beach debris. And of course, don't miss the pair of koalas. They're visiting us from the San Diego Zoo. So from fish to fowl, there's a menagerie of wildlife waiting for you and the family. You can learn more at jbzoo.org. And you can see even more animals at the 2022 West Michigan Pet Expo at the Delta Plex. That's happening all weekend long. The two day event is on Saturday and Sunday. Features a petting zoo, pony rides, a reptile and amphibian exhibit. On site adoptions from animals, rescues and shelters will be on hand. Plus vendors will have thousands of animal products for sale. And there's, there's entertainment too. You've got the Canine Stars Stunt Dog Show. Tickets are six to $12, depending on your age. You can get more at deltaplex.com. Hey, the most action-packed motorsport in the world. It's tearing up the dirt at Van Andel Arena. Monster Jam 2022 is back for some full throttle family fun. And the best part, the audience determines each show's winner by voting. Plus, you could even get down on the track and get up close and take photos with the drivers and those mean machines with pit party passes. Now, there's a show tonight at 7, two shows tomorrow and Sunday. Get your tickets at Ticketmaster.com. And the Coopersville Farm Museum has another Kids, Crafts, and Critters event lined up for tomorrow from 10 in the morning until 1 in the afternoon. It's a completely free event for kids and their families. You can build a birdhouse, make some soap, build crafts. Plus, there's a petting zoo with friendly animals. All waiting in Coopersville. Get more at coopersvillefarmmuseum.org. We'll be right back.